almost 90% of you watching aren't subscribed. So smash that button and it'll make me a happy boy. Please, it helps a ton. And if you do, I'll give you a free kiss available in my Discord. Yo, what up, gamers? It's your boy, Rain. And look, I I just got to talk about this because this is just... <laughs> This is just fucking ridiculous. So what I'm going to be talking about today is a YouTuber named Technicals. You may have heard of him. He makes really interesting investigative sort of content. And around a couple of weeks ago, he made a video covering the Tempest NYC and Red situation and kind of like all the degenerate shit that's been going on recently with like the GGST Pro scene. But after giving it a full watch, you can see that this person took a lot of time to really like see what they're talking about, getting as much information as possible, and then really dissecting it down and breaking it down and taking a pretty, like, relatively neutral stand. Just kind of seeing the entire shit show for what it was. But this man has absolutely copped it on Twitter. People sending him death threats, telling him he should kill himself, you know, that they're gonna physically assault him, find where he lived. Like, oh my Jesus Christ, this is the most egregious shit ever. From from what, bro? From what? He made a video talking about some shit that happened in Guilty Gear Strive, and you have all these brain-rotted autistic schizoids just going at absolutely bonongos on him. Like, what, dude? What's going on? To which eight hours ago, he posted, I'm being threatened by the Guilty Gear community. And this video just highlights all the egregious shit that people have been saying to him. And it's like, what's going on? Is this, the <laughs> like, this has to be such like a, a loud minority, right? There's, there's no way that this is the average Guilty Gear player. Like, at what point in your brain do you, do you realize that, oh, hey, this guy made a video that I may necessarily disagree with or not like. The next logical thing to do now is to threaten his life or to <laughs> kill him or to, you know, do some egregious shit. Like, it doesn't make any sense. What, like, what time frame do we live in now? Seriously, these people need to wake the fuck up and like, get real. You know what I mean? What is this, fucking Lord of the Flies? I have the speaking conch now. <laughs> it's like, what, what's going on? If you haven't seen these two videos, I heavily recommend you watch them. I watch them all the way through. They're really good, entertaining videos and give a good breakdown of the situation that's happening. But yeah, this man's just copping strays. And he makes such funny jokes and stuff to it. But like, I mean, ultimately, someone sitting there threatening your life over something like this is the next level, like, low. And it's not just one person. There's a lot of people who are, like, saying this awful degenerate shit. And I mean, I'm not blind to this shit, you know what I mean? Like, two and two together, you know? The Guilty Gear sort of fandom and, you know, be being on the spectrum, they kind of go hand in hand, you know what I mean? There's nothing wrong with that. But for people to sit there and threaten someone's life over just covering a topic is just... It it it's in- it's insanity. I mean, making content on the internet, especially in Guilty Gear, like, I've had my fair share of just people just saying awful dumb shit. Like, as an example, I had somebody who runs this, like, hourly Elfelt, like, Twitter fan page, and they were basically saying my thumbnail just promoted- promoted porn to children, and then I'm a all <laughs> and, like, they're anti-porn and, like, all this shit, but then they just post, like, fat Elfelt. Like, what's going on? I mean, look at this, man. It's, like, made-up fairyland. I don't think this sort of thing necessarily reflects the community. Guilty Gear Strive and, you know, the FGC as a whole is one of the most inclusive communities you could be a part of. Like, it, so is- doesn't matter your race, ethnicity, creed, sexuality, whatever the fuck. Everyone's a whole umbrella. Everyone's welcome. But it seems like these outlier peoples have, you know, it's been become so inclusive that it's now exclusive. Which, if a dude wants to talk about it, which self-admittedly he said he doesn't play much Guilty Gear Strive, he can talk about it, bro. You <laughs> like, I've been on the internet for a long time. For longer than some of you little kiddies have been alive. And I mean, telling someone to k themselves on the internet is nothing new. This isn't- <laughs> this is- we're not re reinventing the wheel here, right? It's It's been around for a long time. Like, even for comedic value, telling someone to, you know, eh. and these people aren't saying you should do it. They're saying we should do it, which is, <laughs> that's, that's, uh, uh, that's illegal. <laughs> you can't. Dude, oh, it's just insanity. And I think it highlights itself well within the videos of just these people instantly contradicting what they're saying or believing. That's like the- I don't know if they're like fully cognitively developed or there's some issues there or what's going on, but like, bro, yeah, this it, it's just nuts. Like, I love Guilty Gear. I love this game. I do love the community. And it's because I love the community I'm sitting here making this video. Like, even in my regional sort of scene, people have just gotten to this state of like saying wild heinous shit or like, you know, putting their like <laughs> outlier take two cents into public conversation like uh, I, I don't know but if you want to be a normal socially well-adjusted person i would heavily recommend not threatening someone's life if they disagree with your opinion or have a differing opinion to you and people should have the freedom to just talk about what they want to talk about and not get <laughs> you know and not get a bunch of schizoid anime profile picture motherfuckers <laughs> trying to hunt them down and if you're a sane rational <laughs> logical thinking person 
You should hit subscribe on uh, my channel or like like the video or something. I don't know, do something cool. But yeah, Technical seems to be like, you know, laughing about it and, you know, making content about it or whatever. But still, the, the behavior is sort of egregious and shouldn't be accepted or tolerated anyway. Like, uh, you know... It probably doesn't bother him, but it's still not nice regardless. And if you're one of these schizoid motherfuckers, you better- You better reel it in! You better fucking reel it in or you're gonna deal with me, mate! I'm fucking two, six foot of Australian muscle, mate! You're not gonna be able to- well, Get a 4X in me, mate! You're not gonna win! So you better calm down and stay in your little room with your little Sonic virtue, fucking motherfucker! Yeah. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna link the videos in the description. I 100% recommend you go give them a watch. And bye bye!